So welcome back guys, welcome to another video of the Ultimate Team Road to Glory, poor man Road to Glory, uh, on FIFA 23 Ultimate Team. So, uh, on the season progress, we've managed to get to this first player we get to pick. The uh, options is uh, Storyline 09, near, near Kate, uh from the Portuguese League, or this right back from the Eredivisie. Um, honestly, I don't know. I don't have that many Englishmen in my team, so he won't really link to anyone. They're all 82 rated. Honestly, I think I might go. I don't even know. Casha Wurjo? Casha Wurjo? Casha Wurjo? I'm guessing that's how you say it. Near Carte, he's got all right pace. Good physicality. Not the best of passing. Okay, defending. It's not major. But he is French. I've got a couple of French players uh, who we could link to. So possibly he might. Do you know what? I'm going to go for him. Oh, we can see him properly here. Um, see, 09, 09 has actually got all right stats. But. Screw it. I'm going to go for his right back. Something a little bit different. We'll go for him. But. I don't know if he'll start or anything. I don't know if. I really don't know if he will. He might just go on the bench and just be another player, but I'll take a free 82 rate player. I don't know who the other players are. I think you get one more player, yeah, when you get to level 30. It's either Rodriguez, Almada, and Brobby. Not a bad little player to, to play to find. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Ultimate Team video in FIFA 23. So, a little bit of an update video on where the team is, because um, I've done quite a lot of... Um, Changing around the team and doing a lot more gameplay behind the scenes. Like, I managed to get 6,964 points in squad battles, but I will be doing more to hopefully get better rewards. Um, obviously, we've got four days at roughly to next division ones. I've not played that much division. Um, I've got two wins. I'm just waiting to, I'm just going to play a bit more. But I just wanted to let you know what the team's looking like. But also, in this part, I kind of wanted to talk to you about. The players who I found who were pretty decent in this game, who I found uh, surprised me of how good they are. Obviously, the team is looking very, very different to what. You, to be honest, I've not actually played with a couple of these players I bought in. Like, um, I've just recently brought in Emma Martinez just as a bit of an up upgrade on Unai Simon. So, gone for him. Also, I've got the storyline Casan uh, Wardu. He's actually not too bad. He's actually really strong on the ball. Like him. Gabriel, this this guy is. I'm really really surprised at how good he is. He is a really really tough defender. Um, obviously Fafana as well. He's a bit meta in this game and really really cheap. So if you really need a, a quite a quick centre back and someone who's a decent defender, this he, he's he's worth it. He, he he basically goes for like a thousand coins if you can get the right price. Tierney, I'm very very surprised. I packed him and he replaced uh, Majuaku uh, who I had there before um, I've just got him as a backbone so he's alright Savanir he does the job I've got to say he's probably one of the next ones to probably get replaced even though he's one of the higher rate players he does the job I think he's a little bit slower but um, I don't know if I might put another chem style on him possibly but Paulina I've just picked up because I've started to go for this little 4-4-3-3 four, 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 three, three in defensive and I had Calvin Phillips, but he weren't really doing the job for defensively, so I need someone who had slightly better defending stats than him. So I've gone for Polina, who's I've gone up against him a few times. He's a tough defender. Gravenberch, he I've actually put the eye test, so he gets that lengthy of what everyone's talking about. So obviously he's got a little bit more pace, passing, physicality. He's a decent player, and he's got a hell of a shot on him as well. To be fair, so he's a big player. Not tried Bergwijn yet, but I've been told he's alright on the game. So, But also, um, I bought him mainly so I could occupy Gakpo and get him on full chem. I've got a catalyst on him. Um, I don't know if, honestly, if I bought an architect, I may become a Olympic player. I'm not too sure. But I put him in a team, and obviously it's a big shock because um, I've um, swapped him in for Vinicius Jr. 
Um, it was a hard decision because I didn't particularly want to get rid of Vinicius Junior. I'm not planning on getting rid of him. Um, he's just going to be on the bench, and I'll maybe I'll see how Bergvine is, and even if I have to, I'll just sub him in for Bergvine in games if I have to. Uh, but just to keep the chem style. Um, got Darwin Nunes up front. Do you know what? To be fair, he is actually starting to win me over. In 14 games, he's what he scored 15 goals and four assists. So. He's getting more and goes assists in every game. Obviously, in some games he goes missing, but I'm hoping he just keeps going now. Gakpo, he does, he's doing all right, but to be honest, a lot of him will have He's coming on like later on in the games. Uh, he's not starting many games, but he's still got four goals, four assists. So it's eight goals and when he's not been the starting left winger is pretty decent, to be fair. Savini, I can't really complain about him. He's got eight goals, 11 assists. Um, just look at any other stats. Uh, Graven Birch, he's got four in two and in four matches to be honest. So he's got six goals assist him in four games. He got a hat trick in one of his games. Um I will be re recording a little bit so you can you'll be able to see his team in action a little bit. Um I'll even play a little division rivals for you. Uh or a little bit of squad battles possibly. Um because obviously that's the next one and it's literally coming out in within the day. Um, another couple of players, obviously, are Pax, Thomas Muller. I don't know how, how much I like him, if I'm honest. He's, a, he's an alright player. Werner, I don't think he's as meta as he was last year, but he's still fast. Phillips, half decent, but he's not my cup of tea. Rodrigo, good, but again, he's just not working for me. Madison, I'm really annoyed because I really would want to use him more, but I can't because he doesn't really fit my team. He hasn't got the pace to be on my right wing, so... Um, Kalulu... This is another player I've got to say is really, really worth. The, if you're just starting out, he is a great starter centre back. And to be honest, I put him in sometimes if my centre backs out. Come put out, as you see, he's played 19 games. That's most of my games. Obviously, I've not played as many games as I'd like at this point. Um, that's why I'm going to be. I'm going to smash in a game every now and again. But obviously, I want to get keep got, keep up to date with these videos. Keep you up to date with the team. Um, I can't promise how much gameplay you're going to get. Um, honestly, I'm trying to grind the game to get a good enough team to get enough wins because I want to get into the weekend league. I'm not going to be able to get into this weekend, obviously, but I want it for next weekend. So I want to do that, and then obviously I want to make sure we're getting good good um, rewards because now we've got the ones to watch, and we've got the team of the weeks, and we've got the road to knockouts so it'll be, be some good good rewards coming guys so hopefully stay tuned because you never know we might we might pack one we've actually had some okay luck with packed because obviously we packed down nunez from there we packed savanier we packed uh, james madison and obviously i packed um Vinicius junior in in one of them and thomas muller so you know what i bought i got some really high rated cards in them in them packs so and let's remember, I've not spent a penny on this game. I promise you, I've not bought any FIFA points whatsoever. This is a what all I've grinded for, and that's. And to be honest, I'm really happy with the team we've got. I think, we, and to be honest, I'm not doing anything special with the custom ta tactics. Only like wingers to get in behind, stuff like that, and obviously to come back on defence. Um, chemistry, I'm trying to get a little bit higher, but there's not really much I can do about it, really. Because it's mainly seven years off off chem. Paulina, it's mainly in the midfield or all off chem to be honest. But I don't know. I'm still figuring out the, the chemistry, so we'll get there. B way, guys. Uh, I might quite play a quick little game here, but I'll, I'll show you a little bit of a uh, gameplay. What the hell? What's the camera so slow for? I 
got seven here. Let's go. This is why I can't really get go. He always pops up with a goal. Jack Poe gets us the ball. Come on. Free goal lead, Darwin Nunes. I've got to say, when you get, when you got a second just to lay it off, you've got that second to get that shot off of him. He's actually got a really good shot on him. He's just sometimes he's, he lets you down. Oh, Vinny Junior is just fresh on. Oh, I just couldn't get it to anyone. There we go. Big win. But there you go, guys. We get to see the team in, in, in action a little bit. Honestly, uh, I'm, I'm liking our team's feeling. Obviously, we went 2-0 down. It wasn't ideal. But to be honest, a lot of that was down to my defending. And sometimes I think it's just the game defending as well. But happy with the team. I think I might stick with mainly this team for the foreseeable future until we get some rewards and see if there's any players who fit into our system. But really happy. Let's go. Okay, so I'm doing this newcomer challenge too. Uh, this is what I've had to do. Basically, obviously, you get your five max country and regions. I've got five eggs. I've got Spanish. French and I've got quite a few regions actually um, I think uh, that's, that counts as the second one I'm not too sure but either way you've got uh, you need at least four from the same league and also you need a, a minimum of one silver player I've got three I'm trying to I'm trying to use the least valuable so obviously these guys are never gonna get in my team but yeah we'll go this it you never know 75 plus you could get something really good. I don't think it's something you can do again. I have done that, but obviously it's just a it's just a position modifier. Can't really speak. But yeah, there's nothing else new in squad builders, and to be honest, I just haven't got the the players for doing any of it unless we get some really really good um, packs for squad builders. That's why I'm going to probably try and play a bit to get the points up but we'll see if we get a decent player here in the 75 rated I hope so it's a gold player wow wow I get a 75 plus and I literally get a 75 player wow that is just well, that's a kick in the bollocks what a wit literally I gave up higher rated cards than that Oh, they, they are the kind of annoying packs when you get them like that. But either way, I'm just going to I'm gonna be playing a bit of division and a bit of a, a, a squad battles. Mainly probably squad battles just because uh, they're the next ones are in. I don't know what level I'm on right now. My ranking... Well, this, from what the level of this is the rewards, we're going to get a jumbo and a prime mix. But I want to get up at least. I want to at least get up to a. Uh, I'd love to at some point get in the one top two hundred, but that'd be. That'd be really really hard. Um, but either way. Um, Gonna leave it here. Hope you enjoyed this part. It's gonna be we're gonna be mini videos these, but obviously I will keep you updated with the team if we get and then obviously I will be doing another video tomorrow um for the squad battle rewards and then we'll do a bit more gameplay and probably do a bit of division and I'll let you know and if there's any other SBCs out, you never know. But thank you so much for watching guys. Please like and subscribe. See you next time guys, take it easy.